Welcome back everybody to Built and Bought Campers and another video from the workshop. We have a guest visitor coming today and somebody that's not been to the workshop before, we have met him. You've probably seen by the thumbnail who it is. Yes, he's Will from Will's Whereabouts. He wants a little bit of a hand with a couple of jobs on his van. <clears throat> I'm not gonna tell you what jobs they are until he's in the workshop. Um, we are doing one thing to his van. If anybody was paying attention on his video at the Camp Creator weekend, you know what we would be doing soon. Anyway, he's due any minute now and we're getting rolling into the workshop and we say hello to him and then we'll get on and do some work for the day. So yeah, he's traveled quite a way down. He's come down you know, to come and do this. So we need to do a lot today to make it worth his while being in the workshop. Anyway, We'll wait until he turns up, shall we? behind me Will is now in the workshop and here he is here we go. <laughs> right so today we've had a little bit of a discussion so we've got a tiny little bit of a leak over in that corner over there so we're going to try and sort that out for him and where he's put some battens up we're going to put another one up at the front and at the so, back and at the back <laughs> I've got I've got to make use of this help while I can. <laughs> it's always going to be here. <laughs> we don't rush. I learned that by the first one. Darren from the South Central Build Get Together told me that. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, we're going to put a baton up the back there as well for him. We get a baton at the front. We're basically going to do as much as we can today in the day, make use of the time. Um, he's got some wiring up there. I think we're going to take the solar panels off, oh, yeah. get them because we're going to be moving them for him. And we're going to be, we've got a few little ideas in the pipeline for him. As I said earlier, I'm not going to say too much. You just have to wait and see what happens. And anybody that was at the, has watched my video on the content creator weekend might get an idea why he's coming here. You might do. Anyway, so we're going to crack on with this. Less of me talking because I can half waffle. Um, we're going to cut some wood, get the battens up and see if we can send him away a happy man. Sure With no I'm leaks. Sure. <laughs> yeah, that's the main thing. No, no leaks. leaks. <laughs> no water leaks. Please no. Because you're off away, aren't you? Yeah, well, Scotland uh, in like a week and a half. So I can't, have, I can't afford to have any leaks. And we know how much rain comes up in Scotland. <laughs> so we don't want any leaks when he goes there. Oh. Right, okay. On that note, I'm going to leave you for now. I'll be back to you in a little while and we'll show you what we've done. Right, so we're making progress. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Will's up there being busy. <laughs> so, our little contraption in here is holding that batten on the roof in place. Because that has been sicker flexed up there. Yeah. And now, the first solar panels are now being removed from the roof. Let me take you up there so you can have a look. And we're now cleaning off all the excess sicker flex. Um, with this nice green stuff which seems to melt the Sikaflex very well or a little bit anyway so we was busy scraping away breaking your tools <laughs> yeah here we go you bending have, a scraper you can have that back I tell you, <laughs> I'm not letting him anywhere any more drills I see what he did to a step up drill bit after about 10 minutes flat I've had loads of them in my life and I've broken one so it's very entertaining today right so there you go. All we've got to do is fill those holes. Put a bit of primer on it. Wheel's cleaning those at the moment. All that lovely six flex is coming off. So yeah. It's a bit warm as well up here. <laughs> so right, I'm going to put you into some time lapse footage now so you can see us doing some work and some real work.
Right, we have now done the first unistrut. Let me show you where the nuts, the nuts have come through and the bolts come through. You know what I say? Let's have a look. So there's one there. Gone a bit further along. So four bolts are holding this unistrut in place. Let's go up and have a look. So there's the first one. It's all been primed and undercoated ready to be painted. And there's the bolt. And what we've done, we've used mastic tape, which is over there with Will. And now we've done the first one and shown Will how to do it. He's going to be doing the second one. Wish me luck. And I'm entrusting him with my step up drill bit. How am I going to make a mistake here? No, I trust him. I've got this. this he's not, got this. It's not too difficult. We got, he's got this. Yeah, he can do this. Let's go and watch him. Right, so now we've finished putting the roof rack on. Well, the first part of the roof rack anyway. Um, both, it's 2.9 meters of unistrut each side. Um, if you look at the back there, you can probably just see them at the end. Anyway, we're gonna reverse the van out 
and where Will had the leak, oh my God, where Will had the leak in the van, we're gonna put a hose pipe up there and do a leak test. And obviously we do a leak test on the Unistrite itself to make sure no water's gonna come in. Especially with this up and coming trip to Scotland ahead of him. Last thing you want in there is water. <laughs> All over his bed. So his trip would be shut, cut short otherwise. Right. Anyway, let me get the camera up there so you can have a look at it all in place now and what we've done. everybody I hope you enjoyed today's video and hope you enjoyed seeing Will in the workshop I must admit that guy is such good fun um, we have to take things seriously obviously we're building these vans and tools and things but you know he's one of the funniest guys on this earth and you know I love working with him I've got to admit it he's one of these guys he's a bit infectious um, I'll tell you something I don't anything anybody could ever be down or I suppose depressed around him. Anyway, uh, on that note, I just want to say a huge, massive thank you to all my new subscribers. And there are a lot, and a lot of them have migrated over from Will's channel. Thank you very much. I do hope you enjoy the videos as much as I enjoy making them. Uh, Will will be back in the workshop again with us soon. I think he's coming down for a couple more times. We're going to be painting his van. We're going to be building up the roof and setting it out in a much more sort of logical way. Also, he wants to have decking up there. So we'll be doing all that for him in the workshop at some point. So I understand he's in Scotland at the moment, having a little bit of a jaunt around with Charlie and Lauren. I'll leave both their channels uh, links in the description below. But I just want to say a huge, massive thank you to all my new subscribers. And yes, I mean that, and especially my old ones, my old faithfuls. You're still here, you're still going, you're still with me. And again, I hope you enjoy exactly what's going on. And also, I'd just like to know, is there any sort of videos you'd like me to do? Anything you want me to, any sort of content you want me to put out there? Is there anything that I'm missing that you want to see and you're thinking, God, I wish you could do this, I wish you would do that? If there is, please leave your comments below. Let me know what you want me to film, where you want me to go, even if it's places you want me to visit. 
Um, this is all about, tra this is a travel channel and a uh, building camper van channel. So it's not just building camper vans, it's travel as well, creating new ideas, <clears throat> hence why in the beginning um, our titles is build, create and travel. So we cover every aspect of the camper van lifestyle. And in my travels I do list silly things as well. Um, soon you'll see a video come out of me, I spent a day at a track and got to drive some quite uh, amazing cars. Um, well, they're amazing to me anyway, and very fast cars, but that's coming up soon. I've got lots of content coming up on the new van build, which is my one. That's better. I've got lots of new um, content coming up on van builds and also the caravan that I'm working on at the moment. Um, in this caravan we've ripped out the shower completely and we are putting in a recycling shower. Or recirculating shower, you know. It uses the same water that's in the, the 20, same 25 litres of water every time it goes around. So I'm going to take you on that journey as well. We're also building one of those in my new bus. But before I waffle on too much, just the last big huge massive thank you to all my new subscribers and my old ones and again for enjoying my content and let me know if you don't enjoy it tell me you know i prefer to know or if you want me to change something you know it's best knowing and i hope you're having a good day I hope you're staying safe I hope you're staying well and most of all staying really happy and it's bye for now